Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you camera tips and tricks for the Honor Magic 5 Lite. So first of all, let's start from the photo mode and uh, right here we can simply uh, change the brightness level by tapping on the screen and then moving this sun icon. Take a look. You can also do this automatically by tapping on the screen once. If you want to zoom in or zoom out, you can simply click and hold on the slider. Take a look. And you can smoothly zoom in and zoom out with your one finger. You don't have to pinch a screen like that. Next, when you want to take the photos, you can also use this shutter. I mean, normally you can use the shutter, but also we can use the volume buttons, the volume up and down, take a look. You can just click once on each button and the photo will be taken. You can also take the series of the photos by holding one of these buttons. It works the same for this shutter right here. So we can click and hold it and the phone is going to take burst shots. Next, uh, we can tap uh, right here on this icon where we can find some kind of the filters. As you can see, they change color and the temperature on our photos. Right now we can go to the settings uh, where we can, for example, switch and the video resolution. So as you can see, it's currently on the full HD, uh, but we can simply go below for 720, for example, uh, to save some space. If you don't have enough storage on your phone, you can simply enable the grid lines and the camera leveler. Take a look. As you can see right now, it appears on the screen and it helps us basically to take better composition on the photos. When you go back to the settings, we can also enable camera shutter delay between 2, 5 or 10 seconds. You can also add floating shutter button. Let me show you. As you can see, it right, it right now appears on the screen and we can simply click once or twice. Also, we can um, click and hold it and try to take series of the photo, but it looks like it's not working the same way. If you want to get rid of that, of that just click on it right here and uh, right here we can also find uh, the multi video mode so as you can see we can record videos from the two cameras at the same time and when you tap right here you can also change I mean you can switch the viewfinder so basically the film uh, we can get the picture in the picture we can also go for the front from the rear so you can decide how to record these videos. You can also go for the more modes uh, where you can find, for example, the high resolution mode. And thanks to this mode, uh, we are going to unlock the 64 megapixel mode. And thanks to this mode, we can find more details on our photos. And we can also zoom in very close. If you want to adjust any parameters manually, you can for sure use the pro mode. Uh, where you can find parameters like uh, matrix measuring, ISO, shutter speed, exposure compensation, focus and the white balance. If you don't know what is going on here, you can tap on the information icon in the right upper corner where you can find the description of every parameter that you have uh, right here on this mode. If you want to take the macro photos, you can simply use the super macro. But in the most cases, it will be definitely more useful to use um, the 64 megapixel mode and simply crop the photos because, as you can see, the quality of this macro mode is actually not good. So, yeah, that's all for this video. Hope you like it.